Hi Vio, I welcome you to Dream TV. It is the station where you watch and learn. I will be taking you through business studies from one. The topic it is introduction to job, to business studies. Um, the lesson is lesson number two. I'm your tutor, Rosie Mudoni. Welcome. Let us look at our lesson objectives. Uh, today we'll be looking at the importance of studying, importance of business studies in the society. So by the end of the lesson, the learner should be able to explain, to highlight the importance of business studies in the society. So you should be able to understand the reason, the purpose for studying business. So we start. One of the, uh, before we go to the importance, business studies is meant to prepare the learners before informed uh, consumers, producers, and workers in the society. So by the end of this lesson, the learner should be able to be uh, informed on how consumers are supposed to, 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 to be treated, how the producers and even how the workers are supposed to collaborate in order for us to, for the business to run well. So let us look at the importance. One, it assists the learner to acquire knowledge and awareness of business terms which is necessary when discussing business issues. So now when we talk about assisting, assisting the learner to acquire that knowledge, whereby now you start discussing other business issues, you are able to understand the business issues. Number two, it assists the learner in appreciating the role of business in the society. So you are able to understand what is the role of business, provision of goods and services. Number three, it equips the learner with basic knowledge, skills, and attitudes for self-development and nation. Let's take on now you're supposed to start a business, how you, you just look at the opportunity gaps, the, the opportunities, how you set the ideas, what you require when you're planning for the starting of that business. By the end of the course, you are able to understand all those concepts. Even when we talk about the operation of business. So uh, within the course, you are able now to understand or now businesses are supposed to be operated. Number four, it makes the members of society to appreciate the need for good business management practices. So within the course, there is the business management practices that are supposed to be taught to the learner. So by the end of the course, the learner is able to understand what are the importance, what is required for the business management practices to be good. Number five, it assists individuals to acquire self, discipline, and a positive attitude towards work. You know that you must work in order for you to get something. You must work in order for you to produce. If I tell you don't work for you to produce, then it means that you need monetary value, monetary, in order for you to acquire what you need. So that one now creates the self-discipline, positive attitudes towards work. Number six, it equips learners with ability to promote cooperation in society through trade. You know, you need um, the retailer in order for you to get that commodity. You cannot produce that commodity and yet you use it. So you have that now cooperation. You must cooperate with the people who are bringing those goods to you. Number seven, it enables the runner understand the role of government in business activities. 
So in this case, now you get the learner is taught or now government get involved even when it comes to the branding, even when it comes to the start of the business, you know how, business, how government is involved in these activities. Number, seven, number eight, it equips individuals with ability to understand the role of communication and IT in business management. This is the modernization of the way the business is being carried out. Number eight, it helps the individual to develop positive attitude towards the environment. You are going to appreciate the way the environment is after the, the, the course of the business studies. It equips the learner with knowledge and skills to evaluate business performance. This is when now we start looking at the accounting, we start uh, evaluating the business uh, that is done in business studies. Number 10, it helps learners to develop various interaction abilities. That, that is acquiring, inquiry, critical thinking, analyzing, interpretation, rational ju judgment, innovation, and also the creativity. Number 11, it creates a strong foundation for further education and training in business and other related fields. Number 12, it enables one to understand and appreciate the basic economic issues that affect the society, like the changing prices of goods and services. You are able to appreciate that. Why today the price is low and tomorrow the prices are high? Number 13, it enables the runner to acquire skills for, for wise purchasing and selling of goods and services. Having that as act, uh, importance, you can have this activity, discuss ways in which business studies is important to the community. For reference, you can visit the KRB 2011 Inventor Secondary Business Student Book 1, then edition, uh, if I tell you have any question, you can get us through the SMS. You can also get us from the YouTube. You can get us from the Facebook. You can also get us from the Twitter. Stay tuned.